Hey, what's going on guys? This is Tyler, pharmacist with Pharmacy Update, and today I want to talk about a new nasal spray that was recently approved for depression, and that is Spravato. And this is just going to be a quick overview today, not going to go too in-depth. Um, I will discuss some general information on the drug, how it works, how this drug will be administered, and at the end of the video I will discuss how much this may cost you if you want to try this medication. So here we go. So first, just some general information on the new product. So Spravato was approved by the FDA on March 5th for patients with treatment-resistant depression. And treatment-resistant depression, this is people who have tried at least two separate antidepressants at adequate doses and for an adequate period of time, but they did not find relief. And if you want to try this medication, you must also be taking an oral antidepressant with it. Like I said, it comes as a nasal spray that you will give yourself. And probably one of the main reasons that this is getting so much hype is because it's also used as a club drug. Um, so it is the S enantomer of ketamine. And what enantomer means, uh, it's for substances, there is an S and an R enantomer. And they are kind of like your hands. They are mere images of each other, uh, but they are not identical, if that makes sense. Um, so this drug only contains the S enantomer of ketamine. Ketamine has been used as a street drug for years. Uh, it also goes by the name K, Special K, and Vitamin K sometimes. And when I get into the side effects of the drug, you may understand why it is used as a street drug. So how does it work exactly? Well, honestly, we really don't know. It is an NMDA antagonist. So it blocks these receptors in the brain, but they aren't quite sure how this helps with depression. Now, this is a brand new way of treating depression, which is why I find it quite interesting. Previous treatments really were limited to modulating serotonin, or SSRIs, and also norepinephrine, and dopamine with Welbutrin. And these really have been the only options, FDA cleared anyway, for doctors uh, for years and years and years. So it is nice to see a new novel treatment coming out. I also actually read where the substance of magic mushrooms is actually in late stage trials as well. So watch out for that. And one nice thing about Spravato is that it does work very quickly with SSRIs and other current treatments. It really takes weeks or even months uh, to get the full effect of the drug. However, with Spravato, you can see relief within hours or days. This is why I personally think that it may have a role in suicidal patients uh, because it works so quickly. So now, what will you have to do to get this medication? Well, it isn't easy. Um, first, like I said, it's only for treatment-resistant depression. So you will have to first try at least two other antidepressants and fail. Um, and Spravato can only be administered in a clinic under the supervision of a healthcare provider. So this isn't something you're just going to go to the pharmacy and pick up. You're going to have to go to the clinic each time. Now, in the clinic, you will give yourself the spray after instructions from the provider. And after this, you must be monitored for at least two hours in the clinic. So this may be an obstacle for healthcare facilities uh, just to find space for these patients because they'll have to stay there for two hours. Also, on the day that you get this treatment, you will not be able to drive. So you must have someone to drive you home. And just very quickly, what the course of treatment looks like. So for the first four weeks, you will get one spray twice a week. After that, for weeks five through eight, you will get one spray weekly. And then after that, it will either continue to be the spray weekly or you will get a spray every other week. Now on the side effects, and some of these, like I said, you will realize why it is sometimes used as a street drug. Um, so dissociation, this is sometimes characterized as an out-of-body experience. And this includes difficulty with judgment, attention, and thinking. Um, you can also feel sedated, dizzy, you could feel like you're drunk. It can also increase your blood pressure possibly, so that's something to watch out for. And then it also causes stomach issues such as nausea, vomiting, and it can also possibly make you feel anxious. And now my final topic, 
How much is this possibly going to cost you if you want to try it out? Well, it is not cheap, as with most other new drugs. The wholesale cost, or what the clinic is expected to pay, is $4,720 to $6,785, and that's just for the first month alone. This would not include um, expenses from the clinic, such as your doctor visit or administration fee. So this will be pretty pricey if you want to try this. And then as far as follow-up treatments, you're looking at a wholesale cost of uh, $2,360 to $3,540. So it's definitely not cheap, uh, but some people would pay anything to get rid of their depression. And one possible silver lining, this drug is approved for depression by the FDA now, so your insurance may possibly cover it, um, but that would ultimately be up to your insurance company. So that's all I have, guys. I want to thank you for watching. If you want to keep up with the latest pharmacy and medical updates, please subscribe to my channel. Um, also, please comment below with any questions or concerns you may have, and I will try to get back with you. I will also leave a link in the description below for the official FDA announcement for Spervato. So thank you guys again and have a nice day.